Some tenants in a North Omaha senior living apartment complex tell us they're fed up with the living conditions. We're told there's a bed bug infestation along with water and heating issues. Six News is on your side asking Omaha Housing Authority about what's being done. They're elderly. It, it, they shouldn't be treated this way. Frustrated and angry, don't begin to describe how Demetria Harrison feels about what she says is going on inside Evans Tower. Tuesday, she got a call from her sisters that her 79-year-old father was taken to the hospital. When we had received some paperwork saying that he had parasites on him that identified as a bed bug. That's when Harrison rushed from her home in Georgia to Omaha. She says her father hasn't been doing well. He's been developing rashes and can't stop itching. The last few days, she's been cleaning his apartment, and she says she found roaches, bed bugs, and termites in the carpet. Not only that, Harrison says other residents complained their water and heaters weren't working. Harrison says they brought this up to management. The management that was there, the first thing she, she says is, oh, well, just leave. Valerie Johnson Stewart has faced the same issues with Underwood Towers. She says in 2016, she helped her elderly disabled sister move out because the living conditions were unbearable. A social worker came to the building to visit her. She discovered all the bed bugs. And then as we talk to other people in the building, we hear that it was an ongoing situation. While that was years ago, Six News has learned there are still complaints about bed bugs today. We talked to Omaha Housing Authority who oversees both properties. They tell us they're taking action. See if the complaint on Wednesday, our staff was in there the same exact day. Um, if we have a known bed bug situation, for example, we are treating in that unit at least every other week. Omaha Housing Authority also plans to make water and heater repairs to tenants in need. On your side in Omaha, Johan Marin, 6 News. Omaha Housing Authority plans to complete all reparations by Tuesday of next week.